This is the VOA Special English Economics Report. The United States has a new health care reform law. The main goal is to ensure about 32 million additional people. That is about 95 percent of Americans who are not already covered by Medicare the government insurance program for older people. About 16 million people will be added to Medicaid, the government health plan for the poor. The law will require Americans to have health insurance, with a few exceptions, or pay a fine starting in four years. Also in four years, employers with more than 50 workers will have to offer their employees a health insurance plan. Employers will pay a fine for each uninsured worker. Smaller businesses will receive tax credits to help pay for health plans. People not covered by employer plans, Medicaid or Medicare, could buy health insurance in marketplaces called exchanges. The idea is that competition among plans will drive down costs. States will provide these exchanges by 2014. The law is the biggest change in American health care since 1965. But it is not a government operated health care system like the ones in other countries. President Obama said it provides limited reform. He said, this is not radical reform, but it is major reform. This legislation will not fix everything that ails our health care system, but it moves us decisively in the right direction. Barry Arbuckle is chief executive of the nonprofit Memorial Care Health System in Fountain Valley, California. He says the new law gets the issue of health reform moving. But he notes it is mainly health insurance reform. He says lawmakers will have to reform the way health care is provided. That means finding ways for hospitals, doctors, and other providers to work together more effectively. Mr. Arbuckle also would like to see more attention on prevention, so fewer people need costly medical treatment. The law is expected to cost about $940 billion over 10 years. However, the Obama administration says the plan will cut the nation's budget deficit by more than $100 billion during that period. Last year, the United States spent $2.5 trillion on health care. This was an increase of almost 6% from the year before. And that's the VOA Special English economics report. You can comment on our reports at our website, voaspecialenglish.com.